everybody so good morning so i'm coming to you live it's friday it's friday december 18th at 6 08 in the morning and i'm coming to you live and whispering because the little guy is still sleeping so today i'm gonna bring you guys along with me i am taking i'm doing a whole bunch of running around today so first because i didn't go to work today i'm gonna drop the little guy off at daycare after i went to the laundry mat home depot because courtesy of the little guy you know this guy right here because of him, I do not have blinds. You guys cannot see it, but I do not have blinds because he kept pulling them down. I also have to go to Walmart to finish getting him some pajamas, me some pajamas because I'm totally in love with the onesie pajamas. And then I'm also going to finish my XMAS shopping. I can't say that too loud because now the little guy is starting to recognize what that means and what it is and what it consists of and who it's for. He definitely knows discretion. When, what, who. So we don't... We have to spell out things over here. And I need to run to America's Food Basket, which is our local grocery store. So the laundry mat, well, his daycare, the laundry mat, Home Depot, Walmart, and America's Food Basket. So come on, let's go. Good morning. Hi. Look who's awake. Good morning. What do we do first? Good job, kiddo. You grab your stool. Yep, open. Good job, you're growing up so fast. Do you need mommy's help? Do you need mommy's help? I need a hush. Yeah, good job. So kiddo, are you ready for school today? <laughs> yeah, it's the last day of the work week. Yeah, this is also the last day of the school week. Good job, kiddo. Guess who's in the car? Yeah, you ready to go to daycare? Are you ready to go to daycare? Because you're going to go to daycare and mommy's going to run off. All of the snow, snow, snow. Oh my goodness. Right, Braga? Oh my goodness. I apologize if you guys have to struggle to hear me a little bit. I do have the heat blasting as yesterday. I live in Boston, Mass, so we were hit with a snowstorm yesterday. So, this is what the little guy and I have to deal with. I have to make sure he gets to daycare safely so Mama's going to take him. to go to school are you ready come on come on say hi camera okay, uh, say hi people. Uh, people okay you know you gotta give it up give it up no nope. give mommy passy give mommy the passy come on you ready, ready? jump down <laughs> yay okay hold mommy's hand are you ready to go to school Come on, you gotta hold her mommy's hand. It's a parking lot. Come on. Come on. Yep, here we go. Hi, kiddo. Going to daycare. Oh. Here we are. Go ahead, go to the door. Come on, boo boo. Say good morning. Say hi, Miss Diane. Me, let me take your temperature. I didn't take your temperature. Come on, come get your temperature taken. Oh, we're vlogging. I like this. Okay. Good job. Bye, to mommy. I love you. I love you. Okay, so that's over and done with. Dropping the little guy off at school. Now, it's time for mommy to run her errands. You know, hopefully there's no cars in the parking lot right now at my complex. So hopefully the landlord went and did what he was supposed to do because myself and six others, we were out there for 
four hours shoveling out the walkway when that's not even our responsibility. So come on guys, let's run our errands now so I don't have to run them later. So let's go to the laundromat. All right, and we have arrived at the laundromat. Actually, nope, bags on this side. Try to get here early. So let's go ahead and add money to my laundry cart, credit, still I think I only need about $20 today. Carding. Nice. All set. So good. The downy bead. Here. Now I'm just waiting for this one to come on. So I can throw in my laundry detergent. Throw in my beads. I pull until the ancestors tell me not to. Got nice and sudsy. Put in the beads to make sure it smells good. Oh, yeah. Okay guys, so right now I'm in the laundromat parking lot and I have two washers. So one's on has 18 minutes left, another one has 27 minutes left. So right about the time when I start putting them in the dryer, that's when I'm gonna head to Walmart. And right next door is Home Depot. Well, not next door, but just down the street is Home Depot. And then, by then, by the time I get back, my clothes should be done with the dryer. dryer. And I'm just going to head to America's Food Basket and just grab some. I really want to make chili tonight, so just and grab some necessary ingredients for that. Come home, wrap the Christmas gifts that I get on the way try to take a little nap and then by then I should be able it should be at that time to get the burger man um this daycare closes at five I never want to be that parent that picks him up around that time close to five because I understand that his daycare teachers have to get up and leave and they probably catch transportation um, public transportation themselves so I'm gonna try to bang everything out right now it's 8 16 and I'm gonna probably pick him up around 4 15 so I'll see you guys at Walmart. All right, so guys, oh, fix the camera a little bit. All right, so next stop is Walmart. So the clothes are in a dryer. I put them in a dryer for about uh, dryer for about 45 minutes. So hopefully in that time frame, I get everything I can from Walmart. So I'm just gonna pick up a couple of more gifts, um, some pajamas for me some pajamas for Berga. He definitely needs some onesies. He needs some snow boots, so. Oh, and I just need some, um, I need some more facial cleanser for my cleansing routine. routine. Um, what else do I need? I have a whole bunch of toothpaste. I have a whole bunch of deodorant. I have a whole bunch of bars of soap. And I definitely do need to get blinds. Blinds, so Home Depot. And then I definitely need to head to the grocery store to get a pack of meat and some um, taco mix because I'm definitely going to want some tacos. Definitely, definitely. So I'll see you guys when I get in the store. Okay, we are here at Walmart. 
Oh, and it's not that many cars in the parking lot. And by that many, maybe like a hundred, which is good. Everybody's at work, you know. But I am definitely, definitely, definitely going to grab the necessary so I do not have to go out this weekend. We are in. Let's find some pajamas. Where would my pajamas be? Will they be in that section? I feel like they would. But let's definitely get the little guy some stuff. So. In. Oh, I know he definitely needs some boots. It says do not shop this way, so I gotta go in this way. Alright, let's find some boots for the little guy. Wow, these all look like girl boots. Okay, that's a size 12. Too big for him. Oh, did they leave like a, a small size for for my baby? Size of these. Let's see. Size 12. He's a size 10. Oh boy. Shelves are mega empty. These are totally from girls. So. I mean. A 12 is way, oh, here's an 11. I mean, he's a 10. I guess I can just like double up on socks for him, so. These are actually super duper cute. These are really cute. See what size are these? Are these a 10? These are 11. Cause he's currently a nine in shoes, but oh, mommy has found mommy has found a 10. Now these are cute, and they light up. So okay, so now let's just. I also need to get him some diapers. So grab those and where are my size fours he needs a size four size four let me see hmm newborn two Size six. Four. One. Parents choice. Let's grab these. And I'm going to need also need a pack of wipes. Let's grab some wipes. You know what I want to get? I want to get the bowl. The bowl that goes on the cars. Okay, I got that for him already. All right. He's got, yeah, he's got Batman PJs. He's got Mickey Mouse PJs. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so. Pajamas. Okay. okay guys, so I believe I did ooh. I 
I like these. Me and my coffee, but too bad I'm not a 4-6. I'm not really an eight ten either. But, you know what? Walmart kind of runs big, so. Let's see, this is nice. Me and my coffee. Yeah, I guess. Guess what else is over here? What else? Really cold. Oh dear. Oh, this is cute. So I guess we can just add that to cart. One of the most dangerous things out there to say is add to cart. So uh, let me make put my blinders on and make my way to the checkout line. Y'all see I'm speed walking, right? Before I mess around and buy something else that I really don't need but want and see it and then put it in the cart. But making my way downtown, walking fast, not trying to look before I make a purchase. <laughs> Okay, this lane's open, so. Whoa! And I didn't even mean to spend that. This didn't even Okay. Can't forget the wipes. Okay guys, so it is 1026. So I've been out for a little under three hours. Well, actually a little over three hours. So I did the laundry, carried everything upstairs. I cannot wait to purchase a house. I'm actually in the process of purchasing a home and I'm gonna film the entire thing for you guys because I'm excited. Not only am I excited about purchasing a home, but my twin sister is also my agent, so that's exciting. And I'm going to put money into her pocket. She's going to put me in a home, so I'm going to put money in her pocket. That's how that, that's how that works. So I did laundry. I ran to Walmart. And I didn't go food shopping. Well, I didn't go to the grocery store. I went food shopping just at Walmart, but I didn't go to the grocery store because that would defeat the purpose of going to the grocery store. But I can just go to Walmart and get practically the same thing and i did go to home depot but unfortunately they did not have the blinds that i needed so instead of driving around all the way over there to another home depot i decided i'm just gonna go to another one another day so i'm just gonna give you guys a quick mini haul from walmart so i just purchased purchased the little guy I just got him some some diapers the parents choice diapers so what i do there's 180 diapers in here he's currently a size four he is two months two years and two months old i'm not gonna sit here and say he's 26 months because that's like whatever um i got the little guy some wipes so what i always do i just divvy up the the wipes and the diapers and i put give half to his daycare half stays here so that's pretty much how that happens and he's totally absolutely he needed some snow boots even though he's currently a size 10 these are a size 11 but they're just so cute they're a size 11 and they're so cute and I can, you know, it'll be fine. I'll just put two pairs of socks on him. That works. And I actually, I think this is going to be the last of his Christmas gifts because there's about 30 gifts under the tree. 29 probably belong to him. So this is just going to be the last of it. And he's into cars and trucks. So this is just a super buy Walmart five bucks four dollars and 97 cents so while i'm here i'm actually gonna wrap this as we speak as i got a little gift bag here that says celebrate i'm just gonna quickly just wrap it in some red green and white holiday festive color um paper and just throw it under the trees before i forget throw it under the tree 
And he's very good at not wanting to peek at his gifts, not look like, he likes the idea of having a tree, but I don't I think he understands the concept of Christmas that those are actual gifts under there, like, so he leaves everything alone, so I don't have to worry about him peeking, so just very quickly just threw some tissue paper in there, the festive colors, and I'm just gonna put this bad boy right, let's try to put in this bad boy. Eh, should we put it right over there in the corner? I guess it works. Um, so I'm gonna make it. So I am going to make tacos. So here goes some, just some taco mix. This is easy. Like I said, I'm a single mom. Um, so there's times that I don't feel like cooking or don't feel like cooking a nice job again meal. So I always get him his macaroni cups. Oh, and I actually got a new facial cleanser. So it's the Earth to Skin. This isn't sponsored, by the way. This is the Earth to Skin Honey Manuka Cleanser. It's a calming, moisturizing, soothing cleanser, which I'm excited to try. And I just like, I like, first of all, I like the pump. And I like products that foam up in your hand. And for it to say Earth to Skin, I'm going to take a guess that says it's um probably natural organic maybe you vegan and doesn't use all those harmful chemicals and then i have the matching honey manuka day gel cream as well so i'm gonna actually give this a try what actually caught my attention was the was the packaging even though it's simple it was just honey anything honey in it i just like let me just give it a shot let's give it a whirl and to go along with the tacos i just got some taco bowl seasoning some sour cream I was running out of hot sauce, so we got the Tabasco hot sauce. Got the Tabasco hot sauce for you. Oh, and I did pick up some pajamas for myself. So, I don't really splurge on myself. When I do splurge, it'll be like a pair of jeans and a shirt from Fashion Over that total $30. And that's what I'll splurge on myself for like the month. Like, there is no one more frugal than me. Trust me, I try to save and penny pinch anywhere I can. So I just got these really cute pajamas. Reindeer pajamas. They were size 8, 10. I'm a size 10, 12, but... Oh, and it says oh dear on it. I'm a size 10, 12, but you know what? We're going to we're gonna make it work because they're pajamas, so they're meant to be baggy on you, so I'm sure they will work. And I got another one that says... Need my coffee straight up and down me and my coffee it's a toss-up between coffee and red bull i don't have red bull in the mornings i try not to have coffee and in the mornings not all the time but i got my cheese to go with my tacos i just got some antibacterial wipes what i should have left in the car because i need them for the car my taco sauce the ortega taco sauce and then another help in the kitchen i just got burgers and beefaroni cups because these will help when uh, you just don't feel like cooking but the baby's gotta eat so pop that in the microwave for about a minute and a half and serve it to him and last it's like let me tell you something straight up and down no matter how i'm broke but not how no matter how rich i get you can always count on me having these in my cabinet straight up noodles they're just, they're gonna be there. They just, they're just gonna be there. They're a novelty. They're an excessive, uh, a necessity. Everybody likes them. So no matter how rich I ever get, you're gonna find these bad boys in the cabinet. And I'm gonna continue to buy. Oh, I'm salty because these are the cups. I thought these were the pack of noodles. These are the cup of noodles. No! All right, well. I, I I guess, I guess I'll eat these too. I guess, it's not like I'm gonna have to do the dishes and wash the dish after this because it's in a cup. So that concludes today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Make sure you like, make sure you comment and stay tuned for more videos. Berg is actually starting a goldfish swim class. His first class is tomorrow. I'm excited. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be videotaping that, vlogging that. And even though I'm starting out doing the whole vlogging thing, I also want to videotape for Burgess Memories because he is gonna be making his cameos, his debuts, his features in these clip, um, these clips, these films. 
that I do film and I'm just I'm just excited because my little boy he's growing up so fast and I just want to be, make sure I can capture it Kodak film and all so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video